welcome back to my channel so today i've got the freya's cauldron box to unbox and oh, it feels very heavy and these boxes are usually really really good so let's get into it so i'm just gonna as you can see it comes in just a plain white box and let's open it and this is what it looks like when you open it so it doesn't give a lot away you can't see anything which is really good so we've got our information sheets so this one tells us what is in the box and then we've got a little bit of information about the things that are in the box some of the things and yeah that's what they are but i don't really want to read those out just yet because then it'll give away what is in the box so what i'll do is i'll take everything out we'll have a look at it and then i will go over what is in the box okay so the first thing that i can see on the top is this red calcite chunk open this up and it's come in a little organza bag this time oh, this is my first raw crystal usually i get them finished and this is the first one that i've had <gasps> that is raw and my goodness this is absolutely stunning absolutely gorgeous i'm so happy with that that is beautiful absolutely gorgeous i'm i'm chuffed with this box already just because of that like that's amazing so that's come in this really pretty organza bag so i'll just stick that back in there for now keep it nice and safe okay and we've got some rose petals here and we all know what rose petals are we have got red clover and i love that they come in these tubs it makes it so much easier to store them mm, smells fresh smells nice And we have also got Magical Herb Blend for a restful sleep. Oh, lovely. So this probably got like chamomile and lavender in it. Yeah, I can see the chamomile and definitely the lavender. I'm not sure what else is in there. But that smells really nice as well. Don't know if you can really make that out that smells good and you always get like th three tubs of herbs or blends and you always get an oil as well and we have got lemon oil this time which i haven't got this is where i store all my oils from freya's cauldron on the bottom shelf here and i don't have lemon yet so this should be fun hey, do you know what it doesn't actually smell that strong but it's really nice it's like a subtle lemon smell which is lovely okay is that it it always comes with these like polystyrene chips as well oh we've got some candles down here i can't remember if we always get candles i think we do we've got red baby blue and white this time always come in handy I've got a box full of candles so let me just make sure that I've got everything from down there and at this side we have got sleep pillow spell kit also oh, that'll be what the restful sleep blend this blend is for so you probably put it in this little pouch here and she doesn't include the spell in this that's in all the information sheets so there'll be instructions on what to do I'm guessing because it's just a Ah, okay, so it's just two uh, sheets of fabric, so you probably have to 
get DIY witcher here and sew them together with the things inside and you can always like stick amethyst crystals and things in there just to give it that extra little bit of power and energy so that's that's fun very crafty and welcome to my cauldron kitchen and the cauldron is crossed out I love that this looks like a magnet it is it's a magnet that's amazing this is going straight onto my fridge I love it oh wow that is lovely that is amazing I love that this box is amazing okay oh what's this then we've got like a little wooden plate I'm not sure if it's for crystals or if it's for candles so we'll have to read what it says about this but it's just a little wooden plate there which is very good make me for halloween scarily clear instructions inside fun size cross stitch kit i love this when i was a child about 13 14 i used to cross stitch all the time i used to love it so let's see if i can still do it uh i love that they've included a cross stitch in here it's a very crafty box this month this is amazing i love it okay and then we have got a pentagram i'm guessing it's a necklace got a pentagram necklace here love it i've got my necklace that i got from a uh, witch casket up there i don't wear it all the time that's also a pentagram necklace you cannot have too many pentagram necklaces and i'm so sorry that you can see glare in my glasses i've only just realized but i've been wearing my contact lenses all week and i can't wear them any longer Urgh. so and this is a nice length as well it looks like it's um very long which is good oh is it adjustable oh my gosh it is adjustable you can adjust it to have it whatever length you want it so you just pull here and you can have it whatever size you want that is awesome i love that and that's what it looks like gorgeous and then the last thing that's in this box is a very heavy box so that's empty now this is a very heavy box and it won't be a plaque oh you can't see it but i've put my maybone plaque up there because it's too small to be a plaque oh we've got a little what oh, i missed what is this? oh my gosh this is absolutely stunning it's marble and it looks it's either a sage bowl or a sage bowl a um smudge bowl do you know what it is it's a pestle and mortar but unfortunately it's broken no it's meant to oh it's meant to be a pestle and mortar but it's broken so i'll have to message freya just to sort this out oh no and it's absolutely stunning as well absolutely stunning so i'll just sort that out i mean i could just like use it as two small pieces and not be that bothered about it that doesn't bother me at all but it's absolutely stunning it's like a beautiful marble i love that and that's it for the box this month so let me just go over everything that we got so she's written here 
Hello everyone and welcome to our September subscription box. I know I say it every month, but where is this year going? Still it means we are one box closer to Samhain, woo, next month. We have a wonderful box for you this month and a number of items that quite a few of you have been asking for, so hopefully you will all be happy with our choices. So we've got our lemon oil. Our oil for this month is a lovely delicate lemon essential oil, delicate, see I said that it, it's not a very strong scent. And this is a perfect oil to aid you in your cleansing spells and those where you wish to clear something away. Here are a few more uses for you. Planet, moon, element, water, magical uses provides a clear perspective for divination. That's good. Raises awareness and inspires movement to a higher spiritual plane. Use for moon magic as well as to purify magic or ritual objects. Also associated with confidence, kindness, health, healing, purification and psychic energy. So that's all good. We've got our spell candles in pale blue, which is for peace, harmony, truthfulness, sleep, dream work, patience, wisdom, friendship, tranquility. White is associated with the goddess, peace, protection, sincerity, truth, purification, happiness, moon magic, spirituality, strength and cleansing. But white candles can also stand in for literally every, any colour candle. So if you don't have a coloured candle, always use white. Red is associated with passion, love, sexual energy, fertility, strength, courage, enthusiasm, willpower, protection, lust and beauty. So that's good. And we have two herb pots, which were the rose petals and the red clover and the sleep herb blend uh, which is to go with the spell kit the crystal was a chunk of red calcite and there is also information on that the spell kit is the crafting a felt sleep pillow We've got our black enamel pentagram pendant from, does it say? Nope. It can also be used as a protection charm and placed on the altar during spell work. That's actually a really good idea. I don't know why I didn't think of that. That's amazing. And then you can put it on your altar when you're doing uh, magic work to make the energy more stronger. Pestle and mortar. Mine's broken. We have had lots of requests for one of these to be included in the boxes and at last we have been able to bring one to you. We have used either marble or fossil stone so you could have got two different ones. And there are two designs as well so two different ones and two different designs too. We do prefer to stick to one type and style but sometimes we have to mix and match as suppliers just do not carry the numbers we need. Oh man, so they might not even be able to replace... Um, they might not even be able to replace the... One that's broken so i don't mind i mean i can use it smaller that's that's fine pa pestle and mortar stand also oh, that's what that wooden thing is it's to stand the pestle and mortar on which is really good uh, hang on just one second so that's what this is for it's to stand oh and it's a perfect size as well oh my gosh that is amazing oh I'm so in love with this box. It is absolutely amazing. And then we've got the Mouse Loft Cross Stitch Kit. And that's, that is just so cute. Uh, you can also sew it into a little pillow by adding extra fabric if you are a dab hand at crafting. Which, I'm not going to lie, I'm not too good. I used to do the odd cross stitch and that is about it. So I may just be able to make this. But we will see. I think that's as far as my crafting skills go. So I don't think we're going to be crafting no pillows or anything with it. I don't think I'm going to be stitching it onto any pillows. Um, so that's that. And then this sheet is all about the red clover, which I absolutely love the smell of. And it tells you a little bit about the planets, the elements, the folk names, um, what it's used for, <coughs> what you can do with it. And then there's a little bit about rose petals and the same there as well. And then it tells you a little bit about the red calcite and that has got to be my favourite thing in this box I think because it's just beautiful. And again it tells you about the chakras, the elements, the zodiac signs, magical uses, affirmation, what uh, you can do with it, what energies it's got. 
and things like that which is very useful to have and then we've got how to make the restful sleep pillow and what we can do with it and there's also a little spell that you can do with it too which is very good and then I am often asked if we can include more information for putting into Book of Shadows. So the following pages contain some useful info that you might like to include in yours. Herbs of the Goddess. And Herbs of the Gods. That's amazing. So it gives you all the different goddesses and what herbs are associated with that god, goddess. And then it gives you all the different gods and what herbs are associated with them that's amazing so let me see if Hecate is on here because she's my goddess henbane yew mint willow dandelion wormwood and dandelion oh she's put dandelion twice must be a really good one <laughs> and then let me see if Kudnonos is on here but he's not no can oh yes he is he... she's just spelt it with a k instead of a c that's fine so rue Hawthorn, Wormwood, Mate, and Pumpkin Seeds. Yes. So that is really cool. I love that. And this box is just absolutely amazing yet again. Very happy with it. Everything that we've got is absolutely amazing. Couldn't have asked for anything better. So that's it for today's video, guys. If you enjoyed it, please give me a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and i will see you in my next video bye for now guys